Hi, my name is Stephanie Prieto. I'm an attorney here at the Nieves Law Firm, and today we're going to be talking about citations versus complaints and what the difference is between the two. Now let's start with criminal citations first. Uh, criminal citations are often given by police officers. They are a way to begin and charge someone with a criminal offense, but they don't have to go through the formal proceedings of an arrest. And so what that means is that you aren't taking a booking, you aren't fingerprinted, in fact, you're just issued the citation and then let go. A criminal citation is required to have the date of appearance for the person that's being cited, additionally the location and courthouse where they have to appear, and you must comply with that date. If you don't appear, it gives the court the right to issue an arrest warrant um, or bench warrant in that case, given that you didn't show up to the citation hearing. Now let's talk about a criminal complaint. A criminal complaint comes later in the prosecution stages against you or against a defendant. Um, what happens in these instances is that usually it's given to a defendant during their first appearance in court at the arraignment and this is the first time that the defendant is actually looking at the set of charges that is being brought against them. Now, a criminal complaint is submitted by the prosecution, it's under oath, it's a written document, and it indicates the specific allegations and accusations against the defendant. A criminal complaint will include information such as the defendant's name, it will include the date of the specific allegations um, when the incident occurred, and additionally, it will include the specific accusations, the charges that are being brought against the defendant, and it may include a short uh, factual description of those charges and why it led to those charges. Now, the biggest difference between a criminal complaint and a criminal citation is that a citation does not begin formal proceedings against you versus a criminal complaint does in fact begin formal proceedings against you. And so that's the biggest difference. Although a citation does have the power um, to issue or result in a bench warrant if you don't appear, doesn't mean that the formal proceedings have actually begun because you don't actually know what you've been officially charged with. And that comes through the criminal complaint. If your loved one has received a criminal complaint or a criminal citation and you have questions in regards to what are your rights and or representation um, issues or questions, please do not hesitate to give us a call here at the Nieves Law Firm. We can see what we can do for you.